What's going on, everyone? Chris from PickDogs.com here with your free pick in the Wisconsin versus Alabama. Week 3 college football matchup going down Saturday, September 14th, 2024. Just a reminder, if you haven't already, make sure you're subscribed to our channel and smash that thumbs up. And if you're looking for my best bets, the games that I love, including my daily $19 best bet, head on over to PickDogs.com and click the Premium Picks tab at the top of the page. But let's get to this one between the Alabama Crimson Tide and the Wisconsin Badgers. Both these teams coming in 2-0 straight up. Wisconsin 0-2 against the spread after a 27-13 win over South Dakota last week. They were laying 18.5 in this one. Found a way to win, just didn't get the cover in that one. Maybe they were caught looking ahead a little bit to Alabama, who comes in 1-1 against the number. Also 2-0 on the year, 42-16 victors over USF last time out. Maybe exercising some demons after that really close call against USF last year. But I will say about Alabama, you know, that game I don't think was necessarily as much of a blowout as that final score would indicate is the USF was actually up for the majority of the third quarter and even with five minutes into the fourth before Alabama really started to turn things around and turn the game on its head. And, um, or, excuse me, um, USF was only down by one, pardon me, USF was down by one, but still, it was a tight game. It was a one-point game up until the fourth quarter. So I, I just think that, you know, Alabama opening the game up late was just more about, you know, you know sticking it to them and, you know, just trying to build some positive vibes going forward. I definitely think this is an Alabama team you got to keep an eye on. I think Jalen Milrow, the more he plays, the more he gets comfortable, he's going to be good for this Alabama offense. But Camp Randall's not an easy place to go on the road and win. And this Wisconsin defense is still fairly solid. They're top 20 against the pass through their first two games. And I get it. You kind of got to take these numbers with a grain of salt considering the level of competition on the other side. But still, top 20 against the pass. You know, they're top 30 in, yard in yardage allowed per game. I think they can at least try to keep themselves within reach of Alabama, but I'm also not trusting this Wisconsin offense. They, there's not really a bunch of things they do overly well, and Alabama's still got a strong defense. And I'm also not trusting Tyler Van Dyke if I'm Wisconsin as my starting quarterback. I know, you know, I know they're high on him. I, I'm personally not. I've seen him really struggle, you know, in lesser spots than what he has here. And I just think this is going to be a lower scoring game, even as this game turns into a bit of a blowout with this total set at 49. I could see something like, you know, a 30, 31 to 14 kind of game or, you know, something along those lines where Alabama covers but still comes in under the number. Because if I had to lean towards the side, I'd probably still stick with Alabama here. I'm going to go with the under 49 or under 50 between the uh, between Wisconsin and Alabama. And that's going to be my free pick. But just a reminder, if you haven't already, make sure you subscribe to our channel and smash that thumbs up. And if you're looking for my best bets, you can find those at Pick Dogs Premium. While you're Pick Dogs, check out our betting tools. They're 100% free. They're the best betting tools in the business. And tools that you want to make sure that you have in your back pocket when you're making your best bets for the day's action. Thanks for watching. See you guys soon.